first application in a mass and motion drew. I'm going to just shift my weight from right to left. He's firing right straight. I shift and, and monitor this, then slap this up and over. And it, this, this slap should be, it's what sets him. So it should do that to his body right, all by itself. So from here, as I do this, I drop down into a low horse stance. Uh, as a be, you know, this is the beginning of the, that drew. So here, pop. Right, my left hand comes into his hip crease and the inguinal crease, and presses that button. And then my right, in the drew, I'm coming back up with an uppercut. So here is my uppercut. It would be a, um, a beset luar, in the terminology used for the lower body. Um, we, we use the same terminology whether we're doing it with upper body tools or lower body tools. So this is, is technically a beset luar done with upper body tools versus an upper body beset luar, which is a different critter. So here's my anchor in his hip, then I uppercut for my sweep, okay? And if I have a heavy enough anchor, he goes over. I'm being nice to Tony. So a little bit smoother, less talking. One, two. Three. And then if I end up here, I'm going to take a, this is a modified heel hook, but pin his toes to my chest, and I'm just going to drive this forward, bang, as a shot. What I'm looking to do is tear his knee. If you end up here and are doing this, be very, very careful because the heel hook, or this modification of it, is not a submission. It does not cause pain. You go from, I'm okay, I'm okay, to snap, I can't walk for a while. So, but take this, pop, is what I'm looking for. 